Hello, Leos. This is your X rating for the fire through the night. This is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. <clears throat> this is a general, so it will not resonate for everyone if you're new. Um, welcome to the channel. You guys, please hit the like, share, subscribe button for me. It would be greatly appreciated. Oh, free yourself. I'm incorporating some um, Romance Angels cards, and one just flipped out. Free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. Okay. Hmm. A lot of you have been feeling restricted, really not knowing which way to go, how to move. Um, and I and I get the I get the sense that a lot of you almost feel like a fish out of water, um, like out of your element, um, feeling like you know just feeling different. Not like you belong, but you know, it's it's time to be yourself. Whatever that self is, okay. Ooh, okay, I'm going to take those because two try to come out there. Retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. Hmm. Maybe some of you need to take some time to figure out what it is that you really want out of life. Um, who you really want in your life that sort of thing and love yourself first your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive that's right hmm okay so let's see what the tarot <clears throat> has to say let's see what what is has Leo been going through in the recent past Hmm. I feel like you've been struggling here. I really do. I feel like you've been struggling because I think you have emotions for somebody that you want to express that you have kind of been um, keeping inside of yourself here. Okay. This is, this is how these cards are lying here. It's almost like you're going... Um, like you're butting heads with yourself trying to keep yourself restrained from expressing what it is that you really want it's time to let that go if that is the case for you okay let's see where the oh, where the other person's coming from huh this flipped over like this you know you guys I usually don't read cards in reverse but I feel like whoever this person is that you're dealing with they were trapped for a long time in their own thoughts, um, thinking about things that you know you guys went through or what they went through after the breakup, even. And I feel like they are freeing themselves from that currently. Okay, and I think that's why there's this shift um, in you, like your buddy heads with yourself, because I think you're feeling this energetic shift with this person. Okay because they're no longer focusing on <coughs> excuse me they're no, no longer focusing on the negative things I don't feel okay I don't think they are mm -mm. let's see where you guys are at currently here yeah you you are um, I feel like you have removed yourself also from the hurt um, you're not so focused on it and you haven't forgot about it though because it's right with you in this boat with the three of swords over here and the three of swords over here. You haven't forgot about it um, but I think that you are trying to you're trying to leave that behind because you do want to be in a better state of mind. You do want to think clearly and go towards things that um, go for things that you feel like are um, good for you. I feel like you want to go forward with this individual is, is strongly what I'm getting. Look at this, how this is falling. Retreat. There's two people here. Okay. I think you would like to see um, the individual that you are thinking about leave 
you know, things in the past and not dredge those things up. And you as well, you guys don't have to forget about things, um, but there's a need to forgive and move forward here. Okay, and I think that's what you're trying to do, um, Leos. Let's see where the other person is currently. They're trying to gain their stability. They're trying to find which, you know, what is the best next move for them, I feel, here. You guys are really kind of, um, kind of mirroring each other here. Hmm. You're going in the same direction, but you guys are just, you're going, you, you know, on the same path, but you're going parallel to each other. You know, so that that's good at least for right now. Let's see what it is you guys want. That's what you want. Hmm. You want to be back with this person. I think you want real, true love in your life. Is what I'm feeling. And I feel like that's going to come once you actually come to grips with how you really, truly feel. Um, to not shy away from your feelings is what I'm getting. To feel confident in yourself feel confident in um, the connection that you share with this person and um, you know free yourself from those restraints of holding back holding back the way you feel okay and keep in mind this energy can go vice versa guys <clears throat> let's see what they want okay hmm. I feel like this person wants to <clears throat> See here, you know, this card was upright at one time. And upright is, is basically, you know, being trapped, sitting there thinking about things that, you know, making things much worse than what they really were. Um, this, is, this is not real, this feeling. And so they, they started to come out of that. Um, they have started to come out of that. They are now in the process of deciding, you know, what's best for them um, but I think in order for them not to fall back into that thinking about negative things that happened between the two of you um, or the negative things they think you did or what have you um, they want to be able to talk things out they want to be able to work through things without feeling you know like they're stuck in a place where um, they don't know how to move or where to go or who to talk to if they can't talk to anyone because when you get in that nine of swords feeling where where um, you know your thoughts are like overtaking you then you can't really um, you're not in a good frame of mind actually so I feel like this person wants to be in control of their their thoughts and their actions and you know all of that they want to feel like they're in control of themselves here and not let their feelings and their thoughts take control of them is what I'm getting here okay well, let's see what you guys need what do you need what does Leo need be in your element to be in your element to feel confident to love yourself first to to take control of your life your feelings do what it is that you want to do do what your heart tells you to do is what this is saying if you want this two of cups go get your two of cups okay go get the love of your life if that's what you want do not let, if somebody here has told you that has put some kind of thoughts in your head, like maybe you shouldn't go back, or you know, sometimes people can interfere and think they're helping you, but they're not, um, free yourself from that. 
use your own mind and your own heart to decide what it is that's right for Leo. Okay. And let's see what what this person needs. This could be a same-sex relationship. Does not have to be. But it definitely could be. We have two kings here. Hmm. Yeah. Like I said, this person is just wanting to to balance out their feelings, their emotions, um, when to act, when not to act, when to be still, when to sit on their hands, when to offer their love. It's like they're trying to gain harmony in their life. They're needing to gain harmony in their life um, and not fall back into a place where they are not communicative. They are letting their thoughts rule them. So th this is what they're needing to do. Okay. And they're working on that. Most definitely. Let's see what the outcome is for you guys. Huh. Lee, I feel, I feel that you really want to make things right. Whatever that means for you. Um, you want to balance out the scales. Um, you want an equal give and take. You want to reunite. This is where this is going because with the justice and temperance there, this is reuniting. This is um, harmonic balance in this relationship. If there is an apology that you want to make, I feel like that's what's going to happen. But there will be a balancing of the skills here. Balancing of karma. You know, doing what is almost like taking inventory of yourself, the things that you've done, um, and then kind of comparing, you know, who you are with what you have done and what it is that you actually need to do and then doing that you know let's see what the other person's outcome is hmm. I feel like this person is going to be hard for them to really if you if you try to make things right it may be a little tougher than <clears throat> than what um, you may have thought it would be because at this point I feel like you know they're going to want to protect themselves here and with this energy of the nine of swords you know you really can't blame them because this is not a good state to be in it's really really not so to keep that from happening then this is what they do they ignore a cup. They ignore love because they don't want to fall into that same place that they were before. So they may be um, a hard nut to crack, but I feel like if you feel that it's worth it to you, then um, I think you will. This is at the heart of your reading here. Okay? Keep in mind, guys, this energy can go vice versa. Um, only you guys know what your own situations, you know, what they are, okay? So, my Leo friends, that's what I have for you guys. And um, I'll be speaking with you soon. Bye now.